Okay, this is pretty well flaked. You can see along the ridges are pretty well gone. All I have to do is basically touch it up, take a flake off here and there on this side. And this side has the same. We got all the humps off pretty much. And I may even come back and flake some off on this side. So I'll have to do uh, quite a bit of pressure flaking to get this done. And, and I wear these, the glove on my pad thing because it protects my wrists and, and hands from getting cut. And everywhere we, we took some out, there's a high point, so I want to take those high points out a little more, just refining it. What I'll do is like here, there's a ridge running here. I'll leave that and maybe issue stick that see how it see how it works so I'm, I'm mostly just going in there removing all the real low areas like right in here i gotta get rid of those and you you know the reason you have to get rid of those is when you hit them again you don't want your flay, your hit to be in the low point or you'll dip it more and it'll make it more uneven. This is the most boring part of it. See, now I did that side kind of come back and do the side, the other side, just to prepare those flakes to come off of there to release easier and all that. And again, I go along and take out whatever you don't want to hit or pressure flake, you got to take it out. Should have completely taken out when I was. And I have to realize how far those flakes will travel or how far you can make it travel. So I use this tool if I think I can push them far enough. And if not, then I have to use the issue stick. <laughs> 